What's going on, Internet? Zygix here, coming at you with another Destiny 2 Forsaken Let's Play. Last time, we uh, took out the Fnatic. He's now dead. He's got plenty of bullets in his head. And now we are... St whoops. Well, bumping the mic, for sure. And now we are here to stop Aldrin. We got a little bit left to go. So, so I had a theory here that uh, Aldrin is actually going to be the raid boss. Uh, very likely may not be true. It could be very wrong. We're about to see what happens here. You've no idea how fortunate you are to be my chosen. You hold the flesh of a god in your hands. You are mere steps away from our salvation. Only light and dark together can unlock my way back into your world. That's it. Keep going. Free me! What's going on here? I am genuinely curious. Is he cared now? Oh my god, he actually is! Mara. Like, seriously, he does not have any of that corruption anymore. You brave devil. Actually, you know what? No, I'm, I'm changing my theory now. It's not Aldrin that's the raid boss. It's the... Whatever it, this is. Gonna be Marasov here. Dear freaking God. Crap, we don't get to kill him, do we? Voice of Ribbon. All right. Well, hello. This is actually like the first. Oh, that's actually a first boss. That's actually a... What's up? Okay, it's aggressive! It is aggressive! Never actually seen a boss, or we've never had a boss, that's had a, uh, a health bar there. It's usually just hung up, you know, hung above uh, its head. Just like a lot of other stuff. No, 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 no. You do that crap. Okay, so here's to hoping that it spits Aldrin out. So this thing is like some weird mix of something plus fallen tech plus light. I am. Uh, is that like partaken? Or... Ah, no! Come on! All right, take two. We'll just go at it like. Falls to the wall here. And I uh, don't think... Oh, there we go. We, we heard it. We heard it quite a bit. And it's going to send me to the Ascendant Realm, which actually makes... Well, technically it makes sense. I, I mean, because um, I believe I actually... Your Guardian is an Ascendant because uh, you, uh, you have the Essence from Crota still. You know what, I'd actually be a little impressed to see if uh, Bungie actually, uh, in their story mission, actually uh, put raid mechanics in, like, or, like, it taught you the raid mechanics in the story. Like, you know, and there is something to actually say, hey, yeah, uh, take what you learned here into the raid. That'd be pretty cool. Actually, you know what? Come to think of it, so now I was talking about Borderlands last video. You know, it almost... <laughs> it almost does seem like Borderlands. Um, it's like, I'm I'm not kidding. Almost like, I mean, yeah, the fact that it has a Western feel to it is basically what Borderlands is. It's like a science fiction Western. 
and the fact that you go in that you you go into some alien realm um plus and also at the very end okay so commander steel opens up the vault for the first time gets gets eaten by the destroyer when he gets to the end here aldrin gets eaten by voice of riven I, I'm just I'm just playing here. I know I know that Bungie didn't rip off Gearbox. I mean, I mean it's it's cool that it is. I would say honestly, if you if if you made a game and somebody uh, made another made a game that was influenced by yours, I would consider that a high honor. It says hey, I I I liked your game enough that uh, that I felt that I'd like to you know take a couple of um, a couple of influences from it. Plagiarism, on the other hand, that's a no-no. That's that's kind of a dick move. I believe we had a scenario with that. Like, what's his name? The guy that the guy that was an IGN. I already forget his name. That's how forgettable he is. All I know is that he was he was a dick and shouldn't have done what he should have done. Shouldn't have done what he did. Is he still alive? Well, I would definitely, uh... I would change things up. I mean, because... Steel was dead when... I mean, like, for good. Plain and simple. First, I mean, Aldrin may uh, still be alive. My question is, though, is... Was he under, like, some... If he was some under dark influence, then... Well, yeah. I mean, you kind of don't really have a choice but to forgive him because I mean, he wasn't he wasn't he was under wasn't under his control. Crap! 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 Get out of the freaking black water! Hold on. All right, come here, come ha! Of course he's immune. Well, I think the voice of Riven still does have the overhead, um, the overhead health bar. It's just, it's just not pre- well, you don't normally see it, because I, I don't know if you saw it, but I did for a split second. It, it is there. It's just, I think the, the bigger one overrides it, because he's the big boss. I'm guessing he's the final boss. But, um, anyhow, moving on, I, I still do want to see some kind of, I, I really hope that there is some kind of, uh, further clue as to, uh, what, what, what happened at the end of the vanilla campaign with, uh, pyramid ships. Uh-oh, uh-oh. None of that, Al. If I can actually blow those up, or oh crap, I mean swarm. Go, oh, come on, game. Two hours later. Um, you know, I probably should have used it to finish them off, but whatever. I don't care. Six thousand. What the hell? Ah, uh, yes, of course, the final friggin' M. Bison. Like, you ever hear, you ever see, like, when you, when you get, when you do fairly well into the game, and then just, like, just when you get to the end, it's just like, no, not gonna happen. Yes, I know, I'm totally stealing that from somebody. But it's true, doesn't it? So, stealing a fact. Oh, holy crap, he's... All right, if these little turds can like go away for like five seconds, Jesus, and just get rid of the stupid. Oh my God, no! Can I get you know what? No, Darcy, it is. I gotta get rid of him now.
Open up, motherfucker. Welcome to Earth! Aldrin's dead. Oh, they actually trapped him! And Graham! Ah, oh, it's just Prophet Snow. What the hell? That was anticlimactic. There it is! He just fades! Take it! Take it, take it, take it, take it! Kinda sucks that we didn't actually get to kill Aldrin ourselves. Wait! There he is! Congratulations. You have my undivided attention. Now where's my sister? She's not here, Aldrin. And if she was... This would be a whole lot easier. So... This is to be a reckoning. Wait! Not like this. Look at him. He's finished. Even with everything he's done, we can't just... You have no idea what he's done! If Cade was here, I know what he would do, Guardian. Do you? Yes. What would the notorious Cade Six do? A crack joke as he puts a bullet in your head? Gun. Seems you get the last word. What? <laughs> I don't have that gun yet. I did. I did for her. Oh, well, he was in control, so never mind. He's dead. <laughs> Funny. The line between light and dark is so very thin. Do you know which side you're on? Well, say something, man. Come on. You're not finished! And that's it. We did it, everyone. Aldrin's dead. Sucks I didn't get to use Legend of Acreus and just pop his little head off, like a little pussy he is. So, this is how it ends. Um, I basically unceremoniously just put a bullet in Aldrin's head. But, what missions do we got here, Zavala? Do not think for a moment that I shed a tear over Aldrin. Well, trust me, I didn't either. In another life, I would have killed him myself. But we are guardians. One life is nothing when weighed against the lives of an entire people on the very precipice of extinction. When you pursue vengeance into a foreign dominion, you put all of those lives at risk. The death of Aldrin Sav will have its consequences. Maybe not today, maybe not today, but the day will come. I hope we will survive it. And, uh, no rewards. No rewards from, uh, Zavala, apparently. My core is made to we got one last thing here. I think that's with Banshee, actually. Actually, real quick, want to make sure there's other stuff. Uh, I gotta turn to... Oh, I, yeah, I gotta go talk to Ikora as well. In the meantime, yeah, I got a small mission here with Banshee! <clears throat> you did it. Ace is yours now. I'm glad. Cade would be glad. Oh, we already got Ace of Spades, though. But Ace. Oof. Ace is in rough shape. He'd seen this kind of corrosion since. since. can't remember. Anyhow, Cade would have kept spare parts in his own personal loot stashes. 
yours too now by rights. Drag him down, bring me the parts. We'll get this piece burned again. Wait. So, what do we got here? The in, yeah, pursuits. Let's see, so invasion kills, so that requires me to go to Gambit, and those are not not kills by invading, but actually killing invaders, so. Um, so I gotta get it with a hand cannon. Not too bad, just uh, easy way to do that. Um, go, um, I would, I would recommend Red Death. Well, anyhow, is, what does Ikora have for me here? Kind of, I'm a little curious. Almost finished here. I know it was... I would say Forsaken's pretty enjoyable, and there's a lot more to it, of course, so... Vanguard. What's up, Ikora? I realized the other day... Cade may have been my... healthiest relationship. My hidden agents I must keep at a distance. Zavala and I rarely see eye to eye anymore. My ghost and I... Hey, you never see him. You know that story. As for you, I have only ever been a supporting character in your story. Nice fourth wall break there, Bungie. <laughs> my friend. My ridiculous, funny, constant friend. If we don't fight for our friends, what are we fighting for? What I'm trying to say is, I'm proud of you. And... Okay, I'll take my stuff then. All right, return to. Oh, never mind. We got one, of course. Another, another piece of, another quest, or another step of the quest here. God, almost done here. Pretty sure we're almost done. So anyhow, I will go ahead and meet you over in the Tangled Shore, guys. Alright, here we are. Here is Petra. Let's... What do you got for me? The deed is done. But I can't rest. Hey, what is this? I want answers. I want to know how to protect my people from whatever horrors infect the other side of that gateway. And... The prince must be laid to rest. I'm going through the watchtower to the Dreaming City. Take this talisman. It will grant you safe passage. Follow me when you can. There's no one else I'd rather have watching my back. And if anyone deserves answers, it's you. Okay. And <gasps> we get Vestian Dynasty and it's got Dragonfly. Heck yeah. And that's it. Bungie actually made it abundantly clear this time, but uh, yeah, that is the that's the Forsaken campaign. Of course, there's going to be more to this. I mean, of course, we have Gambit, and later this year we will also have um, we'll have uh, what, 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 the other uh, the other events that are uh, coming later. No time. So anyhow, yeah, that's uh, that's pretty much about it. I gotta say, it's this has actually been a uh, pretty darn good, uh, pretty yeah, pretty darn good expansion. Didn't feel like a load of crap. I mean, I would say up until about the final boss, but even then, when I when I think about it, I probably tried rushing it a bit. But either way, there's still lots of stuff to do because I still have, let's see, six, seven, eight other subclasses that I have to uh, uh, other not subclasses, but just branches and I still have my dawn blade and my void walker uh, subclass branches I need to unlock and uh, oh look at that better gear go ahead and uh, upgrade all that stuff <laughs> but either way yeah this expansion is pretty good and I'm really ha I'm actually pretty happy with it um, I, I think it, it probably definitely outshines uh, uh, t uh, the Taken King for sure um, and the nice thing about this expansion is that it actually leaves you plenty to do uh, well after the campaign is over. But, um, I really don't know what else to say, but honestly, this is actually, but yeah, it's just been a really good, 
uh, it's been a really good expansion and actually actually kind of made me go out and do adventures a little bit I mean you know I've, been, I've never been really used to doing a whole lot of adventures in general I mean usually I've just kind of seen them as side quests but this time it kind of makes you do it um, and that's fine because actually you know it's, it's nice to it would be really cool to actually go out and take out um, and take out the the uh, the barons in any order that you want only thing that I kind of wish that uh, wasn't the thing is that they all kind of ran away or at least you had the option to be able to you know to kill them as quick as possible so if you have the capacity of killing them then you could probably end the mission before you get to the very end but either way those are my thoughts on it and uh, I'll probably be getting the season pass we'll get you know just to get events still a little disappointed though um, that we didn't get to see any any uh, uh any clue as to what the ships were at the end of uh, the uh, what was it the, the vanilla I don't know maybe that might uh, that might be for the next expansion the next big expansion um, but anyhow guys yeah that's pretty much all I have for right about now if you guys like this video uh, be sure to go ahead and leave a like in the like box leave a comment if you like be sure to follow me on Facebook and Twitter and subscribe for more great videos by yours truly I will see you all in the next one. So thank you all very much for watching. God bless you all. See you in the next one.